how to convert a .ess file to a .srt file. To make this happen, head over to your browser and type in the URL box v.io forward slash subtitle hyphen tools forward slash edits. You can also click on the first link in the description to go straight to the page. And the best thing is you don't need an account for this. You can instantly get started. And once you're on the page, you can add your subtitles right here. You can get them from Dropbox or paste the URL of your subtitles. But in this case, I'm going to get it from my desktop. So I'm going to click on upload your subtitle file and then click on your .ess file and click on open. Once your subtitles are imported, you can change the text on the right side. You can even add new subtitles if you like. Hello. This will all be integrated into the SRT file later on. But for now, I'm going to leave it as it is. As you can see on the left side, you can also change the output format. For now, it's .srt, but you can also change it to .vtt or .text. And for the more adventurous people on the rush, you can also click on show more options. And you can change the encoding. You can change the UTF, uh, which stands for Unicode Transformation Format. And you can also resync all the subtitles with this slider, but for now, I'm just gonna leave it as it is. So I wanna download these subtitles as an SRT file. So I'm gonna click on download as SRT. And that's it, that's how easy it is. So all we need to do now is click on download as SRT. So our SRT files get straightly downloaded to our device. And as I said before, you don't need an account for this. So you can do this easy peasy, lemon squeezy. All right, have a nice day, good luck, and see you later.